Oh, not you too. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of glad it's not at my house because now I don't have to clean it up. You're supposed to be waking me up saying that. You got school today, Ender. First day. Yay, you finally get a first day of school. Are you so excited? You've been waiting your whole entire summer for this. Oh, not you too. You sick a little bit, buddy? No? Yeah, you're not hot, you're okay. So Daisy and Amber woke up sick. Daisy actually has a fever and her throat is so swollen. I'm a little worried that she might have strep. And Ambry says her throat hurts really bad and doesn't have a fever, but it's just, I also think it could just be a cold. So I'm gonna wait another couple days. I don't know, I don't know what to do. I'm like, oh my gosh, we had like such a long stretch of being healthy and now school starts and we're sick. Ah. Now what do you got this for, huh? Yes. Where did you get that? I'll go to this. So long story short, I thought today was gonna be the first day I was only gonna have one kid home for school time, and now I'm gonna have three. All the girls, <laughs> except for Robert. Oh, wow. Looking good. That's nice, E.B. That's how your mom used to dress. <laughs> In my first day of school. It is? Are you excited? Next year you go to kindergarten, you're in preschool. So we take your picture? Okay, let's do it. Hi guys, so I'm just taking pictures with my dad. And what do we say? That's it, whatever. Say, let's do it. Let's do it. All right, let's go have you hold your sign for one. Okay, something tells me Evie wants to be in the picture too. It says, my first day of preschool. Ender, good job taking pictures. How come you're so good at taking pictures? We can. All right, Ender, this is your big day. You ready for this? Okay, love you, buddy. Wait, where's my hug? Oh, love you, buddy. Bye. Can I go in for a second with you? No, I'm not too big. Okay, love you, bro. See ya. The boy's off to his second year of preschool. He was like, no, Daddy, I don't want you to come. <laughs> I think he thought I was coming to class with him, not just seeing him off, so. All right, good luck, Ender boy. All right, update. Daisy is not even functioning. Like, she just, she has a fever, and ibuprofen is, like, not cutting it, and she's just, like, miserable, freezing. I looked in her throat and there's like white dots on there and so I'm like, I know it's strep. She gets it pretty often. I like like once or twice a year she gets it and I just know it is. So I'm taking her in to get a swab test. Um, Ambry has a cold right now, but she doesn't have a fever and her throat is not nearly as swollen as hers. It's a little red. So I think Ambry just has a cold. Pretty sure she has strep throat. Hopefully it doesn't spread through the family like it has in the past. So we're gonna go get her checked out because I can't stand to see her in this much pain anymore. So here we go. Oh, Daisy, you look miserable. Are you gonna make it? You don't even know? Of course you're gonna make it, sweetie. I love you. Poor Daisy. There's that. We were in the hall getting her better. temperature checked and she accidentally threw up. And so we're getting her all cleaned up. Now are you feeling better? I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of glad it's not at my house because now I don't have to clean it up. Good job, Daisy. <laughs> Poor thing. Are you shaking? Let me see your hand. Hold it out. Shaking. You cold? You want your blankie? No? Alright, so it's not strap, which is crazy. I'm actually glad it's not strap because. That sucks, but at the same time, I'm dreading what it probably really is because it sounds like it's the stomach flu she threw up. And oh, uh, he said her throat is really red, but it's not. 
it doesn't look like strep to him and then culture came back negative and so I'm like hopefully nobody else gets it because I do not want to clean up throw up for the next week pick a throw up bowl any throw up bowl what's the verdict no strep yay but is that good or bad she has the stomach flu oh you want one? Yeah. <laughs> and a throw a ball for you, and a throw a ball for you, and a throw a ball for you. Ender, how was your first day of school? Did you love it? What did you learn about? I learned about I I I made me we made an oven bath and then and and it was in the oven. <gasps> oh. Gingerbread not in the oven? Yeah, he went away into the light. Oh my goodness. I feel like that is made of tall. We already have that. I I lost it. I I only lost the food. We don't need the food then. You have your cutting fruits you can put in there. All right, here is the haul for the sick kids. I tried to just cover everyone in case everyone gets it. So I got like, cause Evie was nose was running yesterday. So I got her the Zarbies cold or cough syrup and mucus. It's awesome stuff. Like there's really not much you can give to little babies when they have a runny nose and cold because like it's very limited. This is just like, basically a sleep aid and some honey to help soothe their throat but that's what she gets and then um we were out of the motrin ibuprofen for the kids and then we did i got some calm stomach tea that has ginger and peach and then theraflu this is actually in case i get sick because sipping on these lemon hot lemonades when I'm sick, I don't know, it just soothes my throat and it takes away your fever and it just warms you because you're like, when you have a fever, these are my favorite things. Um, I have to squeeze the actual real lemon and then put some real honey in it too, just to make the flavor a little bit better. But once I put the real lemon and the real honey in there, it's actually really good. It's just like a hot lemonade. I don't taste the medicine at all, if that makes sense. Um, and then I just got some kids cough drops and some adult cough drops and then some vitamin C's and some lemon cough drops and then some jello and a bunch of drinks so we have a stock of kleenex we have lots of kleenexes so i was okay there but maybe if i did all this maybe only daisy will get it <laughs> okay i'm teaching these kids what am i teaching you this is how you really eat ramen noodles you just break it open and Sprinkle the flavor on it and just eat it like a cracker, I huh? Like a yeah. Do you guys like it like that? Can I miss her? Yeah. She's not falling. That's good. That's good. Uh. Roberta gets to try all the new toys. Yay. She's got it down. Now I'll go super fast. Just kidding. <laughs> Be careful. We don't want any more injuries. No, anymore. <laughs> No! Let's have you put roller skates on, then no. get on. <laughs> roller skates on top of that. And walking Coco. <laughs> yeah, sure. The best idea I've heard. I bring you gifts of good, great joy. Really? Thank like, you. Are you serious? Yeah. I got him some new pencils and a candy bar. Oh. I'm so proud of him. He had a great day today yeah. at school. Good. Stayed on task, yeah. made new friends. Had a good attitude. Makes my heart happy Davey. to the point of where I just want to cry. I'm so happy. Davey, happy like Davey just got a bunch of these um, chat books in the mail. How many years is this from? Look at EB. Not that many, but. Oh, I think this is EB. That's EB too. <laughs> I'm dying. This is me when I was. <laughs> They're so fun. Not a grand deal. I wish it was. Yeah. We'd love to work yeah, with chat books, me. but yeah, we are loving me. these little what books. Oh, I love the kids look through these at church and it's like they don't get to look at Instagram so they get very excited about these little books and they flip through them all the time and they get confused about who baby what baby's who and so it's cute.
cute. They get excited when they're like, that is me when it's a baby. Ooh, there should be one in there. Do you remember that one where you compared all the babies and said who's who? Uh, I can't wait to see that one. The kids will love that. That's for Roberta. It is almost 8 o'clock and EB just got out of the bathtub and she was demanding to get in and out of the bathtub like she'd pretend like she'd want to get out and then jump back in. She's doing the same thing here with the back door. Wants to come in. Outside, outside, outside. Okay, she goes out. This is the like 300th time we've done this. And now she wants back in. It's really cold and windy out there, but this is the game. I must stay here and open the door. <laughs> 15 more minutes of this, people. 15 more minutes and then I can put her to bed. <laughs> but I wouldn't trade it for anything. She's so funny. Um, I thought it might be funny to open the door just slightly smaller than she could fit. Let me see how it goes. Oh. She knows how to open it. No, but. You'll have to watch the vlog to understand what's going on. <laughs> Let's run free in the wind! <laughs> she sticks her little hand up. Can we go get high? Oh! Yes, my flower! One, two, three. One, two. Okay guys, I think now's as good a time as anything. I gotta take her to say hi to the dogs that live behind us. So, thanks for watching the vlog. See you tomorrow.